break first with busy tool press B or you can click this icon then make sure you turn on this toggle snapping only in the corner of the page so click and create a line and click again and right click to release and now let's modify this line so enter the edit mode by pressing F2 or you can click this icon did not tool and hold shift on your keyboard and just drag it and this too hold shift and just drag it and also you can double click to add some notes and just modify it again I think this is too long then press F2 and click and you can delete this by pressing delete on the keyboard now I want to add some pet effect by clicking the shape first and click and go to path choose the pet effect and find this mirror symmetry here's the default setting the mirror symmetry if you modify the shape the other side is will modify too okay next add some rotate copies so click the shape again and go to rotate copies and you can start to drag the center reduce the number or you can increase it so just reduce the number alright and don't forget to apply the shape we're going to path choose the object to path next what we're going to do is unite the shape with the shape builder so click the shape first and this the shape builder tool or the shortcut is X click so you see this blue height like and just click that now it become one shape okay let's see you can freely change the color or remove the stroke so I want to change the color to some of this teal color you can increase the size so click the shape first and hold control shift to make it proportional scale and next I'm going to add some inner strokes so press control D to duplicate and you can change the color to white and you can scale it down by holding control shift you see this let's turn off this toggle snapping for now so you freely to scale it and I want to change this white color to stroke so you can swap the color so right click to swap fill and stroke you can adjust the stroke width so in fill and stroke tab and let's change it to pixel I want to change it to to pixel only and for the outer stroke so let's set to some this yellow right click just set stroke you can adjust the stroke width too in here let's try 4 or 7 and the last thing I want to add some circular text in here so okay create an ellipse first so Click this icon or the shortcut is E, then hold Control Shift to create a proportional scale. Okay, okay, let's change the stroke to any color, let's say this red. So right click, just set stroke and turn on the stroke width to one. Okay. And now how we can align the circle with this shape. So click the circle first and click this till color shape and on here click and just this align and distribute change the relative to last selected because our last selected is this till color all right can click this center on the vertical axis and this center on horizontal axis I want to slightly move it down you can hold control shift 
and just with your mouse drag down okay and add some text press T and type and I want to remove the stroke because you see the font is in the stroke I want to make it only with fill so right click just remove stroke and fill it with white color just click okay and let's put it and let's put this text on the circle so click this text first and shift then click the circle go to text just put on path okay now you see it's it's follow the circle make the text on here so you click the circle and click again to see this rotate icon right okay and click the text press T and control A can increase the text size to maybe it's too much okay this and I want to change the font to monster red ball okay and rotate the circle again and if it's still too much you can reduce the circle so click the circle and hold control shift okay and click again the circle the text is to space between so press T and press control A that just the spacing you can adjust this press F1 and rotate the circle again send the text to 22 it's okay and add one more shape is for this button so the first way to do it I just duplicate this circle press ctrl D and hold ctrl shift alright then type again okay for easy to understand I want to change the the circle color to other color so I want to put in this orange circle so click the text first and hold shift then click the circle and go to text just put on path okay and you can rotate this orange circle you see it's not in the right direction and let's fix it by click the circle and press V to flip vertically and click again the circle and rotate it or in circle I want to scale it up you can rotate again and press T to edit the text and just the spacing right rotate again now I want to show you some text on escape all done you can remove the red circle and the orange circle so the red circle first click right click choose remove stroke and this two the orange circle right click choose remove stroke but the problem is if you want to edit the text let's try you cannot rotate the circle anymore because it's no circle so it will become this so my method to prevent that is let's undo it make the stroke thin as possible so for this red circle click and go to this fill and stroke and change it to pixel let's try 0 0.1 and this too 0 0.1 and the color same as the background so to do that the first way is using the dropple tool click this dropple tool icon press D and hold shift until you see this 
stroke rectangle and click and this too and press D and hold shift and click this background color let's try to edit text and I want to rotate it by pressing F2 to find circle okay I found the circle and press F1 click again and try to rotate it right that's the tips for you if it's too much you can scale it down so I just select the text and this hidden circle hold control shift and I want to align again by changing the font size and let's modify the position so press F2 to find the circle press F1 click until you see this rotate again this two press F2 click and press F1 and click again until you see this rotate again and you can add some star shape so in this star or polygon tool change it to the star and hold control and you can rotate it to find the perfect star so I think this and you can modify it by dragging this handle and let me change the color some soft yellow color press D and click this color and now I want to add some red PNG by going to fall import just this and click OK and let's stress the bitmap by going to path choose the stress bitmap and you can adjust this but just leave it by default and click apply and delete the original and this PNG you can change to any color so I want to change the same color as this so press D and click Uh, hold control shift press F1 and hold control shift to scale it proportionally and I place it to here let's make some line and distribute place it on the middle of the circle Okay, you still can rotate it. Oops. The circle is this for this stacks. And this two. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next tutorial. Bye bye.